going on guys? Bengal again here coming back at you with another video back on the second channel. I appreciate your support so much on these videos so far. This channel is growing like a wildfire or spreading. I, listen, I don't know. But what I do know is this Byron Buxton card that just came out for Player of the Month is the debut man for the video. And he is very, very good. I'm also going to be having debuts for Shohei Otani and Nick Solak at some point. And you say Nick Solak? Nick Solak, but yes, Nick Solak looks un believable can play every position he's got to be one of the best bench bats in the entire game because he can just play every position but he's one of the better starting second baseman in the entire game and he's pretty much free to acquire so i'm going to do a video with him and shohei otani in the outfield but this is the team i'm rocking featuring this man 83 contact right 95 left 94 power right and 85 left Plate vision kind of doesn't matter. And then his fielding and reaction so ridiculous with 99 speed. I don't think anything's going to drop in the outfield, especially with Trent Grisham. The super fractor, one of one in right. Maybe I'll do his own video. I don't know. I super fractured a card in Diamond Dynasty. That sounds kind of cool. We'll figure it out. But let's go ahead, get back into ranked seasons, nine and two. One loss is a disconnect. And we'll see if we can beat somebody. All right, so we have matched up with an opponent, and he is going to be throwing, let's see here, Herman Marquez on the mound. Pretty good team. Loaded up with diamonds, and of course, Wade Boggs at one of the corner infield spots. So we might have a very good game. Is that too much? Is that too much over the top? <laughs> Xbox player. All right, Byron Buxton. First AB with him. Just trying to put it in play, make contact. Ideally, shoot it to a gap or hit it out. Beat it out, Buxton. Beat it out. What's the point of having 99 speed? I was very early on that. So maybe I do have to slow down the bat a little bit. Not an ideal start to the game with Byron Buxton. Need to be better. There's Acuna. He rips that one to left. That one's ripped. Can we go first third on this? I'm testing it. And the aggression pays off. He tries to get me back at two. We're safe all the way around. Jose Ramirez gets to second. Ernie Banks, two ducks on the pond. Runners in scoring position. Looking to drive him home. Let's actually elevate the ball this time, though. Oh, not really what I meant by that. Can we tag on this? Insanity. We get a hold up. He threw to second. He threw to second. That's pretty good wood just underneath it. McMahon's going to fly out, and we are held to zero runs. That pop-up with Ernie Banks was a killer. I'm trying to pitch to center field flyouts. Exactly. Buxton going back. Tough play to start the game, and he makes it look easy. I'm trying to pitch to center field flyouts. Could get a little bit dangerous doing that. <laughs> but Buxton makes it look easy. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe we're just going to actually have to try and pitch to get outs. Buxton's got a decent arm. Nothing insane. But he gets to it pretty quickly. I thought he was going to go to third, like, for sure. And he didn't. And now he's going to double steal with a bunt. And he's going to be safe. <laughs> Yo, this game. Uh, I talked about it in a stream last night. If you don't follow me on Twitch, make sure to do so. Twitch.tv slash bangle, as always, in the description. Or if you're watching this live, I am live right now. Hit the follow button now. But also, bunting is way too overpowered. It's way too strong. To Trent Grisham. Run on Trent Grisham. You're making a mistake. Against Super Fractor Trent Grisham. Hosed. What are you doing? Tim Salmon. Dead in the water. Turned on that one. Ripped to the gap in left center. Tatis has an easy double. Easy double. And here is the man. Trent Grisham. Shouldn't have swung at that. But that's going to get up the middle. We're running on Kenny Lofton all day. 
He throws straight through to home. It doesn't matter. Fernando scores easily from second base. We have a lot of speed at first now. Don't want a double play. Damn, tried to hit and run. Trent Grisham has second pretty easily, but he got me on whatever pitch that was. Slider just out of the zone. Sixto! Pitcher base hit! Get three, Trent! He runs by it! Get home! Sixto gets a big RBI! And now we have Sixto Sanchez at second base with the player of the video walking up to the plate, Byron Buxton. Never mind. He couldn't take the heat. He got out of the kitchen in a hurry. We'll get on to game two. Facing Jacob deGrom. Full diamond team, including Byron Buxton. We're playing a very, very, very good team. How good is the player, though? Nine and one. Sick. Buxton, another hard out to third. Well, no, I think he made a hard out to third in game one, too. I guess that's just my thing. Yeah, I don't know if I'd say this stadium is beautiful. It's interesting. Acuna, the no-doubter. Fastball up and away off the MLB clubhouse. Ronald Acuna, Apo Taco, ripped. Just such a hard pitch. And I mean that isn't hard to handle, and also it's like 90-plus. As Jose Ramirez also goes Apo Taco. Back-to-back -back jacks for Ronald Acuna and Jose Ramirez. And we're off to a red-hot start with everyone except for Byron Buxton, of course. Player of the video, go figure. Ah, all over it with Ernie, but hey, that's just baseball. Hard ground ball to short, and Ernie's retired. To start this game, decent that time. Going to be a tough play, and he can't make it. Ryan McMahon reaches first on... An error. Tatis is up. Would love to pull a heater here. Can't really pull it off the plate like that. Or I mean, it's not off the plate, but just outside. Like, look at that slider, dude. Great pitch. Just, just slides out of my PCI at the last second. I'm early expecting something a little bit harder there. We got two runs. Not too bad. My fear is that this guy's going to be able to hit. 9-1. and one. Who knows? Maybe one of his losses or his losses, they disconnect like one of my losses. So see if we can get some outs. See, oh, that's not the way the circle change goes. All right. Not an ideal start to the game. Just press the wrong direction on the circle change. I would have loved for that to get out of the zone. Would have loved for that to happen. Instead, no. It hangs down the middle. Unfortunate, but not unexpected. <laughs> that one's going to get through. All right. Could be one of those games. Could be one of those games. Got to strap in and prepare myself mentally. That's actually going to be fair. I might as well just get the out. I think waiting to see if that was going to go foul or not was only going to end badly for me. As here's Byron Buxton for him. OPS of four. And he's batting a thousand. So his first A B with Byron Buxton was a triple. And I guess we can assume the guy rage quit after that. 99 speed flying down the line. But his Byron Buxton makes an out. Ground ball to Ernie. Makes it look easy, and we are out of the inning. The only run we gave up was I forgot which way a circle change starts, and I'm not using pure analog. First pitch of the game. Circle change up in the zone. Cranked. Does he go to the fastball inside thinking he can get me? You can't. Circle change or change up. But I uh, didn't guess that time. Saw the heater, reacted, and Will Smith hits it a long way. That thing was headed for the football field without that monster scoreboard. 110 off the bat. Will Smith. In the eight hole, just cranks one. Whew. That's what I'm saying, Optify. Oh, Luis Castillo rips a single and a left. 
And now Byron Buxton, unfortunately, has only 25 speed ahead of him. So if he gets one of the gap, it's not really like he's going to have a chance to run. So I guess might as well just hit it out. I think he's scared to throw me a fastball. He went to the fastball. I mean, that is just just underneath it with Byron Buxton. Just underneath it. And there's a slider. I knew he was going to start me with the slider. I just couldn't wait back on it. Just couldn't wait back. We're just going to try and just plop this in there. Front door. Ooh, he's all over it. Buxton's going to track this down pretty easily, though. I think the general rule of thumb is if it's not a home run, and it's not like a line drive that just like getting out of the infield. Byron Buxton's going to track it down in the outfield. He's just way too good. He's way too fast. His reaction time's way too high. Fernando makes it look easy at third base. And we're holding on to our 3 1 lead. Looking to extend it, obviously. I'm disappointed in Byron Buxton being 0 for 3 to start for me, but it's all right. We're going to figure it out. I don't think they've really been bad swings. We just haven't haven't been quite good enough. Right, he got me. I'm just swinging at off speed right now. Making it way too easy for him to get out. Got to be more patient, more selective. I can't help him get me out. Stayed on that one a little bit. Early on the changeup, they're going to give me the hit anyway. Probably just going to hold one here. I think that's Otani in left. Not going to run on him. I don't know what it is, but off-speed pitches, and that's 93, but off-speed pitches from righty to lefty or lefty to righty for me this year, I can't handle them. I'm late every time, and I'm not really sure why. That one went away. I mean, he's going to turn two there. Not a bad swing. I'm just early on it. Weird move by the second baseman. And he goes yard with Jacob DeGrom. Tried to go sinker down and in. <laughs> Good on him, man. It's a sick hit. It's a sick hit. Jacob DeGrom's unbelievable. I mean, he's not even on it, and they just gave it to him. But, like, you know, what are you going to do? That's the game, right? That's just baseball. Double play. We got d -row. Mark DeRosa talking trash about me throwing a four-seamer. We got a known sinker baller on the mound here. Listen, I'll get the double play. I'll get it with a slider. Tatis, perfect, perfect. Ripped down the third base line. Thankfully, the third baseman did not make a play on that. And it's an easy double for 96 speed for Nando Tatis Jr. Runner on second to start the inning. Get big man, Trent Grisham. And he's going to shoot that one of the left center field gap. Super Fractor, Trent Grisham. 92 speed. We're going to hold up at two. I just don't want to run on Byron Buxton in any capacity. Not with no outs. Did we get him? We got him! Trent Grisham safe at third. That's how you do it, baby. That's how you do it. <laughs> don't question me. All right, double play. That's why you don't swing the bat with pitchers. That's why you don't do it. That's why you don't do it. Byron Buxton, please get down. First hit all over it on a slider coming in the front door. We just blast it to left. And now with 99 speed, 79 stealing, Byron Buxton is a threat to take second here. Byron Buxton should have second base so easily, and he does. Runner in scoring position, base hit's going to score him with 99 speed. Let's get on one, Acuna. That, is that out? That is out. Didn't need to take second because Ronald Acuna gets his second of the game. One to right. This one goes to left. Ronald Acuna owns Jacob deGrom. I think Trent Grisham could absolutely go diamond. 
as we get Byron Buxton out pulling the baseball. Dude, Luis Castillo's actual garbage. Actual garbage. Floating trees. He's just hanging a slider, dude. Did I really miss my my spot that badly? No, I didn't. Everything just hangs with him. Yeah, Luis Castillo's out of the rotation. Take two on Buxton, though. Hey, he's going to. Damn, good rip. Is that getting out? Or, well, is that going to score a run is what I meant to ask? We might have him at two, though. How, how is he safe when the ball beats him there by a second? Got him. Sinker up and in. Can't handle it. We need some runs because clearly we're going to give up a few. Let's see who comes out of the bullpen. I imagine it's going to be somebody pretty good. We've got big man Tatis Grisham coming up in the order. That's just baseball, baby. 98 mile per hour sinker in on the hands. Late swing. Easy single to center. That's just baseball. And that's ball four. Runners on first and second for Fernando Tatis Jr. He's going to start me off with a sinker off the plate. I'm not going to swing at it. Probably could have, but didn't really feel like it. Maybe go to the 12-6 now. Ooh, fastball down the middle to see if I'm still playing. I am still playing. Does it look like I'm still playing? I ain't playing anymore. No games, baby. Fastball down the middle. Fernando Tatis Jr. absolutely crushes one. 480, 107 off the bat. We got a 10-5 lead. Oh, why did I check that? I didn't mean to. Probably take that result. Keep telling me about the 42 series, Grisham. I don't want him. I want my Trent. Super Fractor Trent has a double and now adds a home run to his line today. 11-5. The Padres go back to back. Will Smith. Hey, that's just baseball. All over it. Going to line out to Byron Buxton. Couldn't lay off that one, though. Couldn't lay off that one. Ah, he got me. Laid on a sinker down and in. And Buxton finds Byron Buxton. Fly out to the track. Tough AB. We, we fought, we fought, we fought. Just couldn't win the battle. I know people are going to be like, what about the DeGrom homer? That wasn't a, a, a pitch down the middle. Yeah, but he, his PCI was like barely touching it. And the game just said, it's a home run. Which, cool, that happens. That's baseball, I guess. But uh, it wasn't like him being all over it. Strike three. Byron Buxton goes down. We got an 11-5 lead. Holding on. Thankfully, Luis Castillo is not in anymore to give up runs. Good take. He's going to go slider down and in. I just have to recognize whether it's a ball or not. That's kind of the game here. That hung out over the plate. I think he tried to go in the front door. And that's going to be a home run? Oh, that's terrible. That's worse than the DeGrom home run. That is worse than the DeGrom home run. But you can say now we're even. I'm not on it. He wasn't on it. Both home runs somehow. Jose Ramirez is just built different. That's going to be an out. Ah, Just early. I needed to be just late. I think it's rocketed the other way. That's going to be a base hit up the middle. It is. Ryan McMahon sneaks one through. Slider. It's going to look like the cutter, but it isn't. And it is just disgusting in combination. Sinker, cutter, slider. I'm not really ever using the four seam. I'm worried that it's going to get mashed here. He just takes it. It's good to show him I have it maybe. And then we'll drop it in for a sinker. It's going to look slightly different and get him late. We're going to pitch. Let him hit it hard. Ah, gets up the middle. Just wanted him to get on top of that. Unfortunately, he gets underneath enough to elevate that into center. 
I mean, he was on top of it. That should have been a double play, probably. Cutter paint. Sit down, DeYoung. Sit down. Change the eye level. Got him. Strike three. It is paint. Limited mobility on that with my back arm hitting the chair, but you get the idea. All right, got to protect inside, but that's a good pitch. I'm just on top of it. Might be a tough play for the shortstop. Will Smith just not quite fast enough, and we got the pitcher spot. Do I leave Shane Green in? I stayed on it. I stayed on it. Get out. I did so well to sit on it. Oh, and Byron Buxton. 99 fielding in full effect in center. Just the wrong side of perfect. Oh, man. I'm very happy with that swing. Just couldn't quite get the result I wanted, obviously. But with Billy Wagner, I just didn't really put it in a spot that I wanted. I need to get the hang of his uh, pitch speed. Okay. Is Billy Wagner BP? <laughs> it's looking that way to start. Infinite ERA right now with Billy Wagner. Billy Wagner's just BP, I guess. What's going on? Supposed to be one of the best relievers in the entire game. And he's just getting torched. Oh. I don't know why I thought there was a runner on first already. I tried to turn two. What a play by Jose Ramirez. Potentially saves a run. If we can just hold on to a five-run lead, I think we're going to be fine. Josh Donaldson's kind of tough. I think this guy's going to be trying to get on the sinker, so... Off speed is going to work. Tatis makes it look easy because it was. All right, Byron Buxton, one for four in his debut. Can I get on one, please? I'm late. <laughs> oh, man, I've just missed with him a couple times now. Rip that with Acuna, but again... That's just baseball. Really tough pitch to hit. I would have struck out if I looked at it. Put the best swing I could on it, really. Just a straight line out. And Jose Ramirez is homeward from the other side of the plate. Twice in this game. And now it does it from the other side of the plate. How nicely was that set up? Third homer of the game for Jose Ramirez. He's pretty good. Okay. So he's thinking, what am I going to do? 3-2. Got to be a hard pitch. It isn't. It's a slider. And it <laughs> was straight up in the zone. And we got a panic swing as he realized it was going to be a strike. Not where I wanted it, but we got the result I wanted. It looked down. Strike three. Swinging. That slider just hung. Why is the slider a pitch that hangs? Why is the slider a pitch that hangs? I did, it was a perfect pitch, right? Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Jose, way to get in front of it. Bat it down. Still holding a five-run lead. Byron Buxton probably not going to come up to the plate again. Need a few hits to get it done. But depending on what he does here, I might counter with a righty. Aguilar, please get through. He has 13 speed. He's going to be out. Would have been nice. I'm up 13 to 8. Why would I steal? He had the double playoff? You're right. It wouldn't let me hook slide. It would not let me hook slide. Well, look how laggy that was. That's really annoying. I went at that? <sighs> okay. That should be one. You need to cover the bag, Familia. Okay. Two seam. Paint. Sit down, Bellinger. And out his Buxton, who has done poorly for both teams today. 0 for 4. Dot. Front door slider. I didn't really get it. And his Buxton homers makes it 13-10. I didn't put it in the spot I wanted to. Good hit, good hit. That's his first earned one of the game, I would say. Yeah, he's all over that. 
he's got to go. I mean, that's a beautifully timed changeup, in my opinion. I showed him the changeup for the first time in the inning, and he just went down and got it. I mean, that's that's a great hit. I got to go to Goose Gossage. We're blowing the game. It's 13-12. All right, that's out number two. Got him on a slurve. Damn, the guys that I wanted to be really, really good for me, Kenley Jansen, Luis Castillo at the start of the game, Billy Wagner, just did not have it today. Just did not have it. And that is out number three. Turn into a really good game, man. Turn into a really good game, 13-12. In my head, I outplayed this guy a lot. Yet he had more hits than me, and I won by one run after a four-run rally in the ninth. So I guess it was all in my head. Good game to my opponent. That one, that one made me sweat a little bit at the end, not going to lie. Byron Buxton, not even a notable player. Not even notable. Jose Ramirez, three solo shots, fairly notable. Up to 528, having some all-star wars down here. I mean, overall, Byron Buxton's going to be pretty good. Didn't have the most electric debut in the world for me. Hitting 167, 1 for 6. D did have a stolen base in there. Just go We're going to find it with him. We're going to find it with him. He'll be in the next video as well. But our next debut is going to be none other than Nick Solak at second base. So make sure you're watching for that one. Hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. And I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy. Over you, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna turn taking it back to the house. Keep yeah. us a joke, I'm laughing so loud.